Good morning, Chicka Pies. How we doing? How we feeling? Welcome to Saturday's vlog. I am not going to show my face right now. I look as what I always look on a Saturday morning vlog. Except for today, I actually don't even have on any bottoms. Like I have on a oversized shirt. So I'm not going to be exposing my body. But I wanted to share this with you all. I've been drinking this for a while now. It's um, This is a new flavor for me today, but I've been drinking the Good Belly uh, probiotics for a while. This is organic Good Belly probiotic. Um, it has 20 billion probiotics. Don't know if that's true or not. <laughs> it's gluten-free, juice drink, and this flavor is strawberry and banana. I just poured myself a glass. This is about the size that you should have. They said 12 days in a row and you will see some form of result, results. Um, I drink it every day, you know, I forget a day here and there or run out of it, but like, um, it will make you go to the bathroom, <laughs> um, which is a good thing, um, because it is getting all the things out of your system that you don't need, um, the harmful things that we have in our body. Um, it's not like, oh my God, I can't function, but, um, running to the bathroom, but it does, you know, give you that urgency to go. And I almost finished my coffee this morning. I've been watching, um, I watched Lisa Lisa D1 and now I'm watching a uh, coffee break with Danny, you know, her weekly vlog thing that she normally airs. And over there, I've got some laundry, um, brewing and I've got to do these nails today. So I've got this set in here. Uh, yeah, the nails need to be done. I'm actually going to be headed out to Houston, um, because I have to go to Houston this weekend. So um, I made myself some breakfast. I wanted to share this with you all. I'm actually having some leftover uh, dinner combined with breakfast. Uh, I often do things like that. So that is um, two little miniature hamburgers uh, with cheese and they have bacon on them. What are those things called? Um, not bite size. what are they called? I can't think right now. But uh, let's see, I'm going to put this on. Let's see if that gets warm. But um, I actually like um, egg and burger. Um, it is the weekend and um, so I I had a burger last week. I hadn't had, really had been having beef, but I... I'm gonna actually switch my eating habit a little bit. I won't tell you guys about it just yet, but we'll discuss it at a later time, you know, when we can talk about, um, you know, I'll do a video or something and talk about it at some point or another. Um, but yeah, so I almost was gonna show you guys what it looked like. I was going to turn the camera around just by force of habit. So um, I'm putting that back in the refrigerator and actually I do need to you all this morning in my coffee I'm having the hazelnut which I've shown this to you guys before but this is what I have in my coffee today so like I said I'm almost done with my coffee I'm gonna sit down here and have myself some breakfast and I'll chat with you guys a little bit later It's called Rocky. This is a blue that I haven't really loved, but for some reason today I'm wanting to wear it. Like I go through these crazy moods, y'all. I want it's a color that I very seldom put on my nails. And so I think because I want something different, I should go with that. So I've got the oil on my nails. 
I'm watching Laura Beth, what is it, 423, whatever, I think, what is, is it 423? Something like that. I'm almost finished with my probiotic, and I think I'm gonna wear my Gucci perfume today. I have one of those little sample bottles. It usually stays in my overnight bag, and um, I found a couple of things hiding in my crazy room in there that I need to get into and work on one of these weekends, but I don't know if you all remember when I bought these these are sunglasses but they're also readers and i have got i had them and look at how dirty the case got out I, I think it was i don't know where it was like how did it get so dirty but it may have been like it looks like it's got makeup on it so who knows but i need to clean the bag but i'm gonna take that with me today i think i'm gonna take my gucci with me today and this is that um x formula which is the thing that cleans your nail bed I don't use this often anymore. I used to use it all the time when I was using the whole set. However, you know, things change, you know, just because things just change. Not because of anything bad. I, you know, I don't, this is one of those things that I tried to decide on if it was really worth the, like, like would I buy it again? I think I, the reason why I ended up with two bottles was because they had, it was cheaper to buy the kit than to buy the um to like to buy it separate so i just ended up or like to buy a polish like i don't know like it was just always because i like the other parts that went with it it was just always good to just buy the freaking kit so anyway i don't know i feel like my nails still feel kind of greasy am i getting I've been dealing with this girl on. Um, I thought I had my. It's just a listing. I don't want to hear about a listing. Um, but she wanted to buy my chairs. And then now I'm not hearing from her anymore. I just don't get that. Like, I would never like Black do as much as these people do, and then like all of a sudden, just you don't hear from them anymore. So, I mean, she was eager yesterday, messaging me all day, messaging me till we in the late. I was gonna say we in the hours, but late in the hours of last night. And. Okay, Chica Pie, so I have made it to the car and I'm actually headed over to um, my hairdressers because, not that I'm getting my hair done today, but I need to talk to her about my next hairstyle running way behind schedule I was supposed to have a video done before I left my house today and that hasn't happened so I'm hoping that I'm gonna have time when I get back before we need to leave out to Houston so I'm hoping he gets stuck at work so I'm not the one that's holding things up because I don't feel like attitude today but I just I had a lot to do this morning like I had to you know I had to repaint my nails because they was looking a hot mess. I had to figure out what I was going to wear. I pretty much got my bag packed. Um, even when I do overnight, y'all, just one night, I still stress out because I hate not having something that I need. So I tried to run through every possible case scenario <laughs> in my head of what I need to have with me. So, but, so I think I have, I have two outfits. I have a dress and a pair of shorts to wear back for tomorrow. I need to run out and do Father's Day pickups. I gotta go pick up a gift card for my son, which I could do that tomorrow because I ride, drive right by an Old Navy when I'm on my way to his house. So, um, and I don't know what the schedule's gonna be like for him tomorrow. I'm sure his wife, she she's such a planner. Like she probably has like this great thing planned for him. And I don't interfere. You know, I usually get my gift and go because I know, you know, that's just a special day for them to um, Father's Day is something that's really dear to my son for a lot of, lot of reasons. And so I let her make the best of it. However, like, cause you know, it's like, you know, she knows him, you know, like she knows like those little things. So, um, 
so I'll probably just be in and out um, tomorrow when I go see him so I could hit Old Navy um, on my way to him which is where I'm gonna get his gift card from because actually I think he likes it when I do that one because he has his choice of three different stores and my son personality is exactly like his mama's because he can become different people overnight as far as the dress like um, you know and yet at the same time it all kind of goes together if that makes any sense whatsoever but um, yeah that's pretty much how it is so he can do Old Navy's more of the laid back um, you know it's like the the weekends more laid back um, hanging out with the family uh, Banana Republic is his work attire and then gap is like that one that falls somewhere in between like he can look like he um, is ready for the weekend and then 10 seconds into it he can look like he's ready for work so I'm gonna stick with Old Navy because I know he gets real excited when he sees Old Navy and Amazon gift cards so I think it's gonna be another Old Navy <laughs> but that's okay because that's how he gets his little clothes because they keep themselves on a very very strict budget so that's gonna happen for me like I said I need to run oh gosh I just hope I'm I hope I have enough no. oh y'all I was about to go into a total panic I was about to say I don't have my phone yes I do okay let me put it on charge because I need juice I need juice baby because probably when I'm riding to Houston I am probably going to be all about um, watching me some YouTube because I know he'll have the music blasting which I get so irritated by y'all it's not even funny like I I know y'all probably think I'm crazy because as much as I love music like I don't love music <laughs> sounds crazy right but I I just can't like I don't know I just can't be into it 24 7 and he is in it 24 7 like um, I dated a guy one time and whenever we would take road trips I loved it so much because we didn't talk I mean no I'm sorry we didn't listen to music we didn't you know the radio would not even be on we would literally be like having great conversation um, making plans yes hi can I have a large diet dr. pepper please Okay, anything else for you? That's it. Okay, Thank you. How are you doing today? How are you? I'm fantastic, thank you. Perfect, thank you. Have a good day. Have a good day. Thank you. She was so cute, bless her little heart. I'm waiting to get my trash can in. I ordered the coolest trash can for my car. Um, I don't think this, I'm gonna reach this then. Okay, got the trash thrown away. All right, okay, get back to what I was saying. But we did, we would talk our entire trip. And we actually went to Dallas quite a bit. Um, when we, 
in those days like that was our place to go and um, we would talk for five hours like just conversating and I loved it like him and I we don't conversate we don't we he turns the music on and I don't want to hear it so anyway this guy behind me wants to drive like the bat of a yang yang but I'm not trying to get a ticket over here in these parts. I still, this is one of those roads that I have never figured out why they have the speed limit so low. They actually lowered it and it drives me insane. So, whew, okay, I'm feeling, I'm feeling hot y'all. <laughs> oh y'all, did y'all see my hair? I'm wearing a little headband because my hair is towed the heck up. So I'm wearing a head, not, it's, it's just a scarf, but I have it wrapped like in some weird kind of way because I don't know how to wrap. So I do my own thing. Like, like who was it? A girl commented on my scarves one time, a long time ago, like a long time ago. And she was like, how did you tie that scarf? And I said, sweetheart, I said, you know, this girl ties her scarves. Just like, she just like reached down there, grabbed the scarf, throw it around her neck and tie. Like there's not really a method to my madness. Like I don't like, I mean, you know, yes, I could do it again. But like, cause she's like, you always have your scarf tied so cute. And I was like, really? I, you know, like I never would have guessed that about myself. Like I just know I like scarves, I tie them. Like, <laughs> and I always feel like mine don't look all like everybody else's. Mine just look like, Whoa. like, you know, <laughs> but I don't know. So that's kind of like what I do with these headbands or head pieces or head wraps, whatever you want to call it. I just throw around a scarf, around the head. I have a lot of hit and misses to where I mean like some of them sometimes it looks like horrendous <laughs> and I'm like okay I can't be seen in public like that and then sometimes I'm like whoa you know <laughs> that one looks good so today it was about six tries <laughs> ah, come on today was about six tries before I got this look and this I know is by I mean it's basically almost like I tied a bandana on my head and then I just took the piece, you know, the, the hang down pieces and just tucked them up in the back. But I tied it to where it, it would kind of like go up because I was wanting to cover up as much of my hair as I possibly can because it looks a hot mess. Like, I'm I'm embarrassed. I'm almost embarrassed for her to see me because I, I'm thinking she's going to be like, girl, what is wrong with you? You're, you're misrepresenting me. <laughs> but it's been life, y'all. So anyway, I actually want to listen to some music. <laughs> go figure that one no I just want to there, there's a song that I'm hoping to hear on the radio because a girl told me about it and I'm probably not listening to the right station that I'm gonna hear that song <laughs> because it, I think it's like a, I think it's well she said it was a rap song but I know like sometimes certain rap songs get played on certain stations like I can't listen to like a straight-up rap station like I I just can't but I want to try to hear the song because like she was telling me the words to it and the only reason why I want to hear it is because she was saying it mimic her life as well as mine uh, some of the things that were being said in the song so I just want to hear it so I want to listen to the radio to see if I hear it but I don't I, I know I'm not gonna be able to sit here and function on that one radio station of ours that have a lot of rap on it so like I like almost every song is rap so I'm gonna listen to 105.3 which I like I said it's gonna be like a zero chance probably that I'm gonna hear it but who knows maybe it's one of those songs that they will throw in every now and then because I do know that they do that sometimes they will throw in a song very randomly um, because of a significance to something in the outside world uh, so that's what I'm gonna do right now and I will check in with you guys a little bit later it this is probably gonna be a long vlog so I don't want to do a whole bunch of rambling because I'm gonna just like it's gonna be like you know a trip to Houston it's gonna be the hotel it's gonna be everything so I'm gonna get off all right so I just left Fatima's and we're all set for this Friday um, we're going to she's so awesome like I absolutely love this lady she has done some marvelous things and her shop looks beautiful um, and um, she's just so good like she knows me like I'm you know how do I put this like oh my gracious I didn't know that was there I'm telling y'all when you don't come to a place for a while but um, there's a convenience store here that I've 
never seen before. But I haven't seen it. Well, I would see it not that long ago. Okay, whatever. But um, she's just so awesome. Okay, Fa fun fact. <laughs> Some people mistake my... Like, I'm kind of high maintenance. Like, I'm not like... I'm not a snooty person. Some people think I'm snooty. Um, some I'm not. I'm high maintenance, which makes some people think I'm stuck up. Um, but I'm not like I'm not high maintenance to a point where I'm not realistic. Like I'm high maintenance because I I want certain things like the like I want them not like I guess kind of like my way, but like um, like like this. Like I've been searching. I mean I've been like searching YouTube like the stalker that I have been lately. <laughs> and, um, I mean, they put people in prison <laughs> for, for what I've been doing on YouTube lately. Like, seriously, like, I am just like, I'm a stalker. Oh, that is so cool, City of Converse, I like that. Um, but I've been trying to come up with a hairstyle. And I went from one, and we're gonna, we'll just do it all in the video where I'll tell you guys what I'm doing and, you know, all that then. But, um, yeah, and I was like looking at one type of video, and then I look at another type of video, and then I look at another type of video. Well, I came to the conclusion of what I wanted, and I'm going to go with what I want. But um, but see, some people wouldn't get that, you know, like, because I'm like, I have to ask a lot of questions, and I want to know this, and I want to know that, and, and how do you do this, and can you do that, and blah, 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 and blah, 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 because that's how I am. Like, I want certain things a certain way. Because I'm spoiled like that like I don't know maybe it's part of my upbringing but again at the same time when I tell y'all I'm like the the most fairest loving person like like I'm not like it's it may come across that I'm that way and like I don't care about other people but like I do which you guys know that and that's why I think I love y'all so freaking much because you guys get me and like you know um, you guys do like you just totally get me I don't know anything else to say other than you guys get me and I love that about y'all so enough of that I've already been talking like three minutes or whatever it is about God knows what because I just ramble sometime and I already said it. this video is gonna be long because I'm gonna be doing Houston and all that stuff so I'm gonna get off of here I'm headed to this hair place and I'm gonna try to find some hair real quick um, well I want to look to see what kind of hair they have and hopefully I'm just amazed that when I drive over in here, y'all, I just, I'm just like, wow, things just look so, so, so freaking different. 254 a gallon. I'm also checking out gas prices, but I'm not, I have, I have a half a, well, more than a half a tank. I haven't eaten at that restaurant in forever in a day. I mean, y'all, these are my stomping grounds I'm passing through right now. My son graduated from that high school right there right there y'all he played basketball he played football right there these are my old stomping grounds i worked literally like like right over there ah <laughs> uh, man it's just time time keeps on slipping 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 into the future fly like an eagle and I used to eat from that church's, on a, like on a daily. He would bring us over chicken strips because he knew we loved them when he come to make, come by our, our job. Like the owner of the place would come by our job and bring us chicken strips. Man, those were the good old days. And that gas station, which I wonder if they still have that Chinese restaurant in that gas station. Oh, y'all, good stuff. Mm. Hey there, chicken pies. Ah, my goodness. Don't be mad at me. Don't hate me. I am in Houston. <laughs> I'm actually, um, we just pulled into the hotel. And yes, Hyatt Spoil Hotel. I'm at Hyatt Place um, right off of, um, what is this highway? I-10, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, it's at Hyatt Place. And so I know I'll be happy. I will show you guys the room. I'm sorry I didn't vlog when we started out, but like I, I'm really stressing out about my hair. So I sat down in the car and I literally started, cause when I left Fatima's, I went and picked up the hair. Well, not all of the hair. I, I picked up one bag, they had it in um, 
an 18 inch, which mm -mm, I don't do all that. Um, so I was like, well, I want to kind of see like what the hair looks like before I order it. And um, yeah, so I'm thinking, you know, like there's this part of me that's just kind of like just so confused. Um, I'm thinking that I'm going to go with this look. I, I'm a little bit worried because it looks weird when I looked at the hair. I was like, oh my gosh. So then I had to sit here and I literally like watch videos on my way here about um, different ways people were doing their hair because I do want individual braids. Um, I'm, well, I'm about to tell y'all what I'm getting ready to get done. But anyway, we're gonna skip all that. <laughs> but for what I want, the look that I want, I need, it's like stressing me out. Long story. You guys don't need to hear all that. You just, when I get it done, you know, we'll discuss it at that point. So anyway, so I am going to, yeah. So yeah, so I'm going to head into the hotel in just a minute. We're getting checked in and then I'll show you guys the room. I actually might not take the camera out to the field tonight, like, or to the park. Um, I'm kind of feeling like I don't want to, I don't know. I don't think I am. I think I'm going to leave the camera in the room or like have it, um, I don't know if I'm going to leave my camera in the room. I always get really weirded out by that. Like, like certain things I just feel like I don't care where I am. I could be in like the, yeah, the most expensive hotel in the world. And I'd be like, I don't know. Because that hotel is only going to be on, as honest as the employees that work there. If you feel me. So anyway. I'm probably going to leave the camera in the room. So I'll show you guys the room. And then um, perhaps I'll do better vlogging tomorrow. I'm probably going to go ahead and combine these two vlogs together. Only because I'm kind of thinking. I don't know though. I talked a lot today. Before I even left for Houston. So, But I was thinking I would have vlogged a lot more. And I just didn't. But um, yeah. So anyway. I'll chat with you guys a little bit later. Are y'all still loving my glasses? Or do you love them at all anyway? I'm asking you do you still love them? Like... I like them. I really do. I don't know. They they just feel so different. And I love the color. I love having this pop of color. And so, yeah. Anyhow, chat later. All right, chicka pies. We're inside. Um, Hyatt Place, like I was telling you a few minutes ago. House. And uh, Hyatt House. I'm sorry. I said Hyatt Place. Is there one called Hyatt Place too? Yes. Oh, okay. The house. We're in the house. And there's the bed over there. Hey, let me turn the camera around. Okay, so there is the bed, which we're on the first floor because we just didn't really feel like climbing upstairs. So on the first floor, so right outside is people. So you, we definitely have to close the blinds here in just a few minutes. Um, I guess this is the closet. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's a walk-in closet. Now that's different. Check it out. Got a full length mirror inside the walk in closet. Got a little safe in here, too. Or, no, it's not a safe. Oh, wow, this is kind of neat. Like, this is like it's got like a little, like, little table thing over there. Mm -hmm. So, like the walk in closet, definitely. And then let's see what the bathroom looks like. Love the bathroom. I always like to check out bathrooms. I love an all glass shower. Like, I just think those are the coolest things ever um it's a smaller bathroom than the other hyatt house i had to think for a minute but um still very nice like i'm okay with it i can live with it and then this is the tv which i think it rotates to the other side also so we've got a little desk area and then there is a little couch well not exactly a little couch it's a pretty big couch and look at this kitchen y'all like it is so bad a Open it up. Huh? Open it up. It has dishes and everything. Well, yeah, because it's the Hyatt place. House. Um, but, yeah, so, and just like the other one we showed you before, it ha it comes with the dishes and stuff like that. But, of course, we're not, like, staying for any period of time. But this is definitely the route to go if you have a family or and or if you're going to be somewhere for a while because, you know, it can get expensive trying to eat out. It even has a dishwasher, a little two burner stove, 
and then there's more storage space up here so if you buy groceries while you're out and about and then over here there's a little mini microwave it's so cute and then there's little paper towels and down here i'm sure will be pots and pans yes there's the pots and pans i don't know how well you guys can see this because i'm in like a dark area but this one has a full-size refrigerator and i don't think the other one did it didn't um so i really like having a full-size refrigerator because i'm saying that like i'm going to stay here for a period of time but like anytime you stay anywhere if you want if you have like i said if you have your kids with you or you're going to be a long period of time where you're going to want to buy groceries you definitely want to have a full refrigerator so that is the kitchen as i back away from it absolutely love it so a real quick view of the room check it out not a bad place and the price we paid for this y'all better than a motel six i'm just saying <laughs> but i love it i absolutely i i love it i love it it just because it just feels like home it's just i don't know but anyway i will chat with you guys a little bit later hey there chicken pies how we doing how we feeling it is now sunday night like 9 30 at night i have sucked at vlogging today i did i even pick my camera up today i don't think i did but um we did breakfast and then we drove back from houston and then i went over to my son's mother-in-law and them for like this quick little father's day celebration and i just got home and i was like i sucked today at vlogging so it is what it is people it's been a fun day uh, we spent it with family starting out this morning and ending it this evening but um look at my hair y'all isn't it cute i've been doing these little scarf things galore here lately i'm like oh how cute am i but yeah so anyway my apologies but i'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog but before i end this vlog i'm gonna give you a quick rundown of what i have on today this is that top that i bought at tj maxx like i don't know like last winter i think it was it was like cold outside and this was on sale or like marked down in the clearance section i think or i don't remember exactly but i was like oh when it gets warm i'm gonna wear that and so i worn it a couple of times and i actually like it a lot and today i paired it with a pair of these little old navy um shorts these shorts are so old y'all like I, when i tell y'all they're old they're very old and they have elastic waist which they have a lot of room in them like they are like a size four but like i don't know they're not truly a size four they're from old navy old school and old navy old school things used to be really really big so I'm not a, a size four by no means, but I love them with this. I love, you know, I've always loved those earthy tone colors. Like I like a beige and a cream or a white and a beige, or, you know, I just like those colors like that. And so um, I thought this scarf would match it perfectly because it has all those earthy tone colors in it. It would just like, you know, give it a little pop of color yet at the same time, keep it looking very earth-like. My locks are looking really bad. So part of the reason why I've been scarfing it because I have several of them that have just gone awry. <laughs> but um, I've been actually, again, today, totally, totally stalking YouTube for videos because I, get, I become very obsessed. Like I told you guys before, I get very nervous. I get worried. I'm like, I hope I make the right choice. So I'm watching all these videos trying to like reassure myself that my choice for my next hairdo is the choice that I want. And I'm going to even watch a couple more before I go to bed tonight because I got to order some hair. And I, because the hair that I want, they don't have it in the store. So I'm going to have to order it, but I need to make sure it's here by the weekend. <laughs> oh my gosh, do I not have drama always in my life? So I end one pack of it, one, because I'm kind of thinking I'm doing a mixture. And one of it, one brand, or not brand, but one style of it is actually going to be on sale and i think the sale ends tonight anyway so but i want to make sure that i get it by friday i'm hoping to get it by friday i need to see where it like if it shows like the shipping and handling like when it's expected and all that good stuff so anyhow drama in my life but i'm gonna go ahead and close out this vlog um i'm actually getting ready to have some dinner at 9 30 at night but um I didn't eat anything this afternoon and I'm gonna have breakfast, some breakfast stuff right now. 
he's actually making me some tacos. So I'm pretty excited about it. You know, sometimes you just want what you want. And it just sounded good when he said he had tacos because he didn't go with me over to my son's in-laws. And um, so he made himself tacos. And I was like, oh, you didn't make me any. So I whined. And yes, it's Father's Day and he's making his own food. But that's the way it is. He likes to cook, so he enjoys it. And we probably would have done dinner, but we did breakfast and at his uh, son's house. And... You know, that we had like a big breakfast and then we did the drive back. So, I mean, we haven't like had an opportunity to really go out to dinner or anything. But we go out to dinner all the time. So, it's not like it's that big of a deal. But, happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. Um, any of my father watchers, happy Father's Day to you. And to all of my lovely women subscribers who have fathers in their lives. <laughs> you know, whether it's their father father or their husband that's a father. A boyfriend that's a father, whatever. Happy Father's Day to them too. Telling this crazy chick named Sheila said, Happy Father's Day to you. <laughs> Y'all know I'm crazy. I always have to do something crazy. Anyway, love you guys a lot. I will check you guys out in my very next vlog. I don't know what time or day or night this is going to go up. But it won't be tomorrow because the girl got to get herself ready for work and all that good stuff. And I'm not going to have time to do all that this evening. So I will check in with you guys a little bit later. It is meant to be. Be, 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 be,